Hi friends, since it is our last week learning about trees, we are gonna do some pine cone painting. So here's a pine cone. Raise your hand and wiggle your fingers if you've ever seen a pine cone. Remember, pine cones come from conifer trees, evergreen trees that look like this. Show you another picture. And remember they have pine needles, conifer trees have pine needles, and these are the seeds that they drop to grow new trees. All right, we are gonna do our pine cone painting. So you need a container or a box, a piece of paper, some pine cones, and some paint. So our first step is we are gonna put our paper in our box or your container. Our second step is I'm gonna add some paint. So in our classroom, this is where we get paint. I'm just gonna squeeze a little bit in here. Uh-oh, they haven't been used recently, so they're not wanting to come out. Let's see if the orange one will work. Oh my goodness, nothing's coming out. Let's see if I can do this one. No one's used them in so long. They don't wanna come out. Okay, teacher Nikki's gonna improvise because remember, sometimes things don't go the way we want. So I'm gonna smell the flower, blow out the candle, and problem solve. You know what? I am gonna take off this lid I'm gonna put this in the sink behind me so I don't make a big mess. And I'm just gonna drop a little bit of paint. So I have yellow, just a little bit of yellow. I'm gonna take the top off of my orange. Oops, I think I got paint on my nose. And I'm gonna put it in the sink behind me and just drop a little bit of orange on there. Uh oh, my orange isn't really wanting to work. It's kind of watery. I think our paint is old. No one's been using it. There we go. And I'm gonna take the lid off my red, shake it up that way it's not watery. And I'm gonna put it in the sink behind me so I don't make a mess and add some red. Oops, that was a little bit, that was kind of a lot. I think I may have put too many. Now I'm gonna put pine, pine cones in there and I'm gonna shake it around like this. Do you see how I'm shaking it, but not shaking it too crazy where the paint and the pine cones will get out? Go like this. And then when you're done, you have pine cone painting. 